back to the channel. Uh, I just want to give you guys a little trick that I do to clean plexiglass windshields. I bought this UTV. It's a 2020 Pioneer. Uh, about a year and a half ago. It's my second UTV now. and uh, I want to give you a step-by-step -step of what I do. And, and it's just kind of a, a little hack type thing or a trick that I, that I do to take the scratches out. So if you would, just watch along and I'll explain it. Let me turn the camera around and I'll show you. Okay, so it's kind of hard to see. See how scratched that is? I don't know. See all the swirl marks, all the dirt? That's that side. See any on this side? No. That's because I already did half of it. But I want to show you how I can make that look like that from, from this. I know it's hard to see, but uh, step by step, here we go. You guys ready? First, clean. This is what I use. It's actually got my old truck on it. <laughs> Not the reason I use it. The reason I use it is because it's time to, time, time to shine product and it's good. So get yourself some glass cleaner, spray it on, clean it off. And let me tell you, that's what makes all them scratches, is cleaning your windshield. But uh, every time you do this step that I'm gonna show you, it gets better and better. The glass seems to get a little bit more, I guess, uh, harder, I guess, to where it doesn't scratch, a little more resistant. So then, we're gonna take this torch right here and let me get the tripod set up and I'll show you exactly what I do. But to explain it, we just we just go over it nice and slow. The key is don't stop. You gotta keep going, keep a rhythm. The minute you stop, you're gonna burn the windshield. So just keep moving back and forth and you can actually watch the scratches just fade themselves away. So just keep doing this inside, outside, everything. We're gonna take care of the spot, the bottom section here. See how that good that looks? That side's horrible. You can see right where I stopped, I did it about the halfway mark. You can kind of see the, the little balls there, that's, that's from the flame. There we go. So you can see how scratched it is. Right here is where I did already. It's not gonna get it perfect, but it's gonna bring it out a lot better than it was. So let me get this uh, set up for you and I'll show you what I do. All right, everybody still paying attention? Torch. What we're gonna do. Put it on high right away. We'll start with the bottom here, just because it's a smaller area. Really go ahead. Nice and easy. You want to go at a medium pace, not too slow. You will burn it. Nice and slow. As long as it's warm. You want to get it too warm. <laughs> Just keep going across. Nice and easy. Now we're going to get back out. We're going to check. Should be all. Got some scratches right here.
One little pesky one. Right in here. Okay. I think we're good there. A little bit I missed over here. Well, come out of there. Can't see it. Yeah. It's about as good as we're going to get that. So now let's go ahead and do the top. Nice and slow. And when you stop, pull it away. Come back in. Sound like a damn yoga instructor here. Nice and easy. Take your time. Don't go too slow though. Are you following me? Gotta warm the windshield up a little bit, but not too warm. Nice and easy. Switch hands. My arm's getting tired. almost like it melts itself back together. Okay. Now, let me get you out here. If I gotta get in there. Let's go back and forth on the windshield. Just like so. There we go. See how it scratches just Stay away. What we want. I've done this probably three, four different times in the past couple of years. I've owned it. And each time, it seems to last longer and longer and longer. So I don't know if we kind of strain the windshield or labor it. I don't know. You pick out a word. I'm busy. Here we go. Just got to have good lighting behind it so you can see the scratches. And it's actually quite rewarding because you can see them just fade away. And then my wife is standing here on the other side of the windshield looking at me, making me nervous. Don't burn the windshield! I'm not. I'm talking to the audience. I'm not talking to myself. Too early in the day for that. Okay, we're back. Here we go. Round number two. This takes a couple times. I 
I'm actually just watching the scratches just disappear. See how close I'm getting with the torch? You don't want to be right on top of it. You want to be close enough to where you can get some heat at it. Because if you don't get enough heat, you're not going to do anything. There's a fine line between not enough, but it's way too much heat. See clearly now the scratch is open. I don't think that's how it's on. Not a trick. Mm -hmm. You know, and if you don't get your windshield clean, you just burn the bug right in. That's fine. Alright. We got one big scratch right down in the center. We're gonna try and take that right out. And we are. So I'm sure a lot of you are probably wondering, hey, we could do that on the rest of the plastic too and take the scratches out. I wouldn't recommend it. Not on the colored stuff. Like the hood and all that. All you do is put little spots in it, so. In any chance, you take a chance at warping it. And don't want to do that either. We'll just do this windshield collar job. That scratch just worked its way right out. Inside for a final time, I think. I think. I think. Alright. The eyes got to get the driver's side better. That way the wife's like, why does your side look so good? Mine looks like crap. Well, safety first. Mm -hmm. Scratch there. Mm -hmm. So this does not work on glass. Do not do that with glass. You're going to get yourself in trouble if you do it with glass. Let's be on the outside. That's a big old scratch. Most of your scratches are going to be on the outside. Okay. I think that's a, that's a wrap. We're in here, though. I don't really want to. I think it's on the inside. Oh, did I get in there and I can't see it?
think. I think that's that's good. She's she's a bit warm. All right. So we got that. Let me hold on. See how scratch this is? That's for like rubbing compound and polishes and stuff like that. That is not for one of these. You will probably discolor this, and I know you're going to warp it. So that ain't so bad. But what do you think? Quite an improvement. We're just going to let that cool off a bit. There's a few little scratches in it, but I don't claim to be a professional. I just know what I'm doing. That sounds right. I don't know. A lot better than it was. That's for sure. So I guess I showed you that kind of what I wanted to do before I left. And I don't know. I'm impressed. So save your money. Keep uh, refreshing your, your plexiglass. That's, that's plexiglass. That's not glass. Remember, like I said, don't do that to glass. Glass, when you get it hot, does really bad things. So make sure you've got a plexiglass windshield. And if it's scratched like that, I guess we can save you some money. So anyways, um, like, subscribe. Follow us on Instagram, uh, www.berrytrucking.com. We've got some merchandise on there. Um, there's ways, contact info, stuff like that. So uh, hopefully I can help you out. I know it's not trucking related, but I said I was going to get into some different things. So uh, I hope it helps. All right. Have a good day.